when asked about my easy easel and how to set it up. This is what you get. comes in a nice light tote bag. Inside you have two parts to it. First is the backing board. And then the tray. They're both made out of aluminium, which is really sturdy and easy to clean. I'll just put the tray down first. It just hooks on very simply and can hold a fair bit of weight. Um, I have it designed to suit my units of pastels. It's, this is a timber set that is quite heavy. It'll still take that, not a problem. Bigger set of pastel, it stays on quite well. These edges here um, are rubber, so things don't, like that box doesn't want to slide off easy, um, just in case you're worried about that. Also takes here's a watercolour set quite easily. Um, nice size for that. Uh, if you have brushes or anything, they don't easily roll off. We're in the middle of designing an extra clip-on water container, um, well, just in case you want one, but that's phase two. <laughs> Watch this space. Okay. Now the backing board, this is how it would arrive. I like elastic bands. You can use bulldog clips, you can use anything. I've just got this set up for pastel, but you can set it up for anything you like. Um, for the pastel people, that little pack would come. That's where I store my paper and glassine. It actually fits an A4 sheet of paper beautifully. Um, but that's for the pastel people. But watercolour people could do that as well. Not a problem. Now, the backing board. The backing board has, it's made of aluminium, but it has a, a foam core on the top that actually has a plastic cover to it. Um, it's the type of glue on foam core. So you can actually wipe it down easily no matter what medium you use. All right, there's also a little let, lip here, a ledge, and it catches any pastel dust you use. Um, we're working with some oil painters who are wanting a, a wider trap or an extra layer to put thick canvas on. And we're halfway through designing that, it's gonna be a little A-frame um, angle that fits and clips onto this base. So you, if you wanted it, you could have extra. But for pastel, I find that's quite a good amount of gap just to catch the pastel dust as it falls. All right, how does it attach? This little block here has a universal screw thread there that works with any tripod. Um, this is a universal size screw. This bit will come with your tripod and you just screw it on. And then I'll turn this around so you can see it from the back. It attaches like that. Tighten up to make it strong. I'll swivel it around to show you. But that's now my painting board. And it's quite strong. Um, you can have it at any angle. You can have it landscape or portrait. You can have it flat for watercolour and drop board down lower if you wanted to. Um, it can be set at any height. And this paper, if you're using pastels, you can use bulldog clips if you want. Uh, the bulldog clip will hold it on quite well if you wanted to. I actually prefer these rubber bands because then I don't get dints in my paper. Holds it on there and holds it on there and it's quite secure. Okay, that's a, an A4 size sheet of Colorfix paper um, and it, it's made to take 
even a quarter sheet if you like to cut your sheets down rather than use the straight size. Or boards, if you work on ampersand boards, this is a um, Richardson board. They actually sit on that panel quite well um, and still have room. Uh, and of course you can have a bigger panel. I'll take these down. Okay, this is if you want to paint bigger. Here's a bigging back, bigger backing board. It'll take A3 size paper, still sturdy. You can either clip that on and it'll be secure, a couple of clips here, or you can tape the back to the board if you wanted to. Um, it comes down easily as well. Just take those to put away. One clip from there. I leave that on this board for uh, my purposes. You can buy extra ones if you want to still use that for your camera and use that for your easel. They're about $20 for the extra ones. Pulls down easy, easy to carry. So this one folds down to go in its own little carry bag. And that carry bag is small enough to fit inside a backpack. My tripod, my easy easel, grab some pastels, pop them into. Very easy. If you would like one, go to playingwithpastel.com and you'll be able to buy one there.